She is an award-winning writer of the hit show Sex and the City and Modern Family. Now she's telling her own story, why she says marriage can be like one long date. A cancer diagnosis is devastating and hope is key to getting through the battle. Today on Delmarva Life, we learn about breakthrough treatments right here on Delmarva. Each year, thousands of children will be diagnosed with cancer. Unfortunately, you not only have to work on getting them treated, you also need to think ahead for their future. What fertility options you need to consider before starting treatment? Well, you brush your teeth to keep your mouth healthy, right? What about your dogs? Uh, you're going to learn how often you need to do it, the trick behind getting their pearly whites clean, and why brushing could be the key to their overall health. And once you know how to take care of a dog, you may want to add one or two to your family. Coming up, we'll introduce you to some animals here on Delmarva that are up for adoption. And many of us made a resolution, but are you still living up to yours? We've got some golden gadgets to help you stick to your goals. And take a listen to this brother duo. This Connor and Chris Poole perform for you today. Delmarva Life starts right now. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Lisa Bryant. I'm Jimmy Hoppe. Welcome to Delmarva Live from Historic Studio T. We just talked about this yesterday. Yes, we did. You remember the whole Target breach thing that we talked about just yesterday? It turns out it is growing. Target announced today up to 70 million customers had their personal information stolen in that data breach that started last Thanksgiving. The retailer had originally said only 40 million credit and debit cards were impacted by that breach. Now their investigation finds the stolen information includes names, mailing addresses, phone numbers, or email addresses for up to 70 wow. million people. Wow, wow. Well, you know, speaking of consumers, wow. yeah. it seems like everywhere you turn, your goods seem to be made in China. Well, that's because they are, and it's official. I mean, oh. we always assume this. China is poised to become the world's top trading nation. The U.S. previously held that position. China reported today, Friday, that its total trade for 2013 reached 4.2 trillion dollars. Oh That's a sharp increase over the previous years. Now this is the first time the world's most populous country has cleared the four trillion dollar barrier. You have to you have to emphasize I, I, trillion. I can't <laughs> even imagine a number like that. No. Talk about China. Uh, their uh, moon rover, they launched a moon rover and uh -huh. they were the third country to reach in uh, reach the moon in December. Okay. Uh, the reason I mention that is because while it was put off several times, we finally got the Antares rocket into the air, uh, yeah. moving at 7,500 miles an hour to catch up with the International Space Station on board a capsule. Pa it just fascinates me to see that. I know, start I know. Moving. We were actually watching it uh, from right our when office. It started, yeah. yeah. 3,000 pounds worth of food and equipment and ants. Ants. We're an educational experiment. Oh, okay. I am. Uh, it should be their Sunday. That's awesome. I'm, I'm sure the guys up at the ISS are appreciating <laughs> watching that. watching the ants. Do you remember Ryan Miner with yeah. the Shorebirds? Oh, well, yeah, guess yeah. what? He's coming back to manage the Delmarva Shorebirds. You know, he was with the Frederick Keys last season, and his wife, Allison, is a Delmarva native, yeah. Salisbury native to be exact. He also holds Delmarva's single season records for hits, doubles, and RBIs as a Shorebird player in 1997. He enters next season 45 wins shy, becoming the all-time wins leader in Shorebirds history. So Delmarva, we're happy to have you. Ryan Miner and yeah. Delmarva will open its season in April. He's a neat guy. He's he tall. Is, he is tall. I, I, he's a lot bigger than I thought he was, but he's a great guy. <laughs> that's so, what people say about you. Yeah, well, that's because they never let me stand up. Anyway, I uh, <laughs> want to say congratulations to Colonel Mark D. Camerer. Here is the former commander of the 436th Airlift Wing at Dover Air Force Base. Guess what? He has been nominated for promotion to Brigadier General by President Barack Obama. He is a command pilot, over 3,700 flight hours, more than 745 combat and combat support hours as well. Congratulations so, to him. Uh, the Art League of Ocean City will hold its fourth and final Empty Bowl project tomorrow. In case you're wondering, it's a mm -hmm. nationwide grassroots effort to raise funds and awareness to those who go hungry. Uh, a grant from the Community Foundation of the Eastern Shore makes it possible and is it's a partnership with Diaconia right. and In the, the Art. Art League. So it's only $20 at the Ocean City Center for the Arts, 94th Street, Ocean City from 1 to 3 tomorrow. If you want some more information, 1 to 4 tomorrow, I'm sorry. Uh, more information, there's the number. You know those days when you just want to play with a friend, somebody just like you? How about Aww. this? Can you see? Isn't that incredible? Now, I'm thinking at first, okay, this, this is nice, this is cute. Yeah. But they keep on playing. 
That's adorable. They Back got the glass and there. Forth. Doesn't he look cute in that tiger suit? He does. Now, you may remember the video that went viral almost two years ago of <gasps> this lioness. Yes, I do. Trying to have a little lunch. Uh, the little lunch here, which is on this side of the protective glass, thank goodness, is dressed in a zebra suit. I don't know about you, but I'm kind of starting to see a pattern here. I don't think I'd want to leave my kid there. Yeah, no. Wow. Yeah. Very interesting. Okay, moving on, because that was making Still me nervous. Still ahead on Delmarva Life. You may not recognize her face, but you probably recognize Cindy Shupak's work. She's one of the writers behind hit shows like Modern Family and Sex in the City. And she's going to join us later to tell us what it's like writing for such A-list celebrities. You know, a lot of us wish that we had the body of some celebrities, so we spend a lot of time working out. We're going to show you a few gadgets that can help you with your weight loss goals. But next, this teen had to make a tough decision when she found out she had cancer. How in the midst of fighting for her life, she's also preserving parenthood. Plus, we'll learn about breakthrough cancer treatments found right here on Delmarva. Delmarva Life, we'll be right back. Del Marvel Life is brought to you by Sussex County Federal Credit Union, guiding you to your financial future. Peninsula Regional Medical Center, honored to serve the entire Del Marva Peninsula since 1897. Your local York and LG dealers, and State Farm Insurance. Like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. <laughs> 